Well, this uh, lady that we're we're shamming, her name is Sarah, and she's very, very serious about her dog. In fact, her dog won some kind of award in 2001. Oh, my God, he's got his own website. Yeah, that's that's true. And so she takes it very seriously. Yeah, we're she mess with it. He's a boxer, I believe. His, his name is Taylor. Now, is Taylor a little girl or a little boy? He's oh, a boy. He's a male dog. Hello. Yeah, I wanted to talk to the lady that uh, has the, uh, the dog. Uh, this is she. Oh, hi. How you doing? This is Bill calling from Jasper, Alabama. This is who? This is Bill. Bill. My name's Bill. Uh-huh. You might want to write it down. My last name is Weed. Okay. W-E-E-D. Okay. And this is Bill. Okay. Bill Weed. Okay. Okay. I wanted to call you about your dog. I've been. Uh, I heard about your dog, and I uh, understand your dog won the award in two thousand one. Is that right? Yes, he did. Yeah, my my dog is also an award winning dog. Okay. Uh, for uh, two years in a row now. Okay. Uh, my dog Snots has uh, won a couple of different uh, awards. I'll tell you about that in a minute. But I live in Jasper, Alabama. And uh, and my dog uh, Snots is uh, is a female, mm -hmm. and I was thinking with all the awards and everything that my dogs won, Snots, and your dogs won, that maybe it'd be a good idea to get them together mm -hmm. in the near future. Well, as far as breeding the dog, I mean, uh, I I don't breed anything without looking at the pictures or pedigree, and then it would have to be agreed upon with, uh, with my handler. Okay, because I've got a pit bull dog. No, well, no, I'm not interested. No, well, no, now before you say that, I think you ought to see Snots. I don't think so. And and what I'd like to do is just arrange a, a time that I can bring Snots by and, and let you have a little look. Well, I wouldn't be interested in breeding no pit bull dog. Well, but you, I mean, you, before you just say that, I mean, Snots is a female dog, like I mentioned a second ago, and you do have a male dog, right? Yeah, but there's a lot of male dogs. I mean, I'll find you a male dog. I'll find you a male pit bull dog. Yeah. What, why, why are you acting so uppity about it? What's wrong with, with my dog? Why don't you want to breed with a pit bull dog? I wouldn't cross. That's just, you know, all you'd have is a mixed breed dog. Yeah. Well, what you got? Uh, I've got a boxer. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what, what award did your dog win? My what? dog won the American Boxer Club National Specialty. What'd yours win? Well, um, my dog won the Ultimate Fighting Championship two years in a row. Well, 2001 I'm not in a, in a fighting dog. and 2002. And uh, we're going for it next year, too, as well. Snots is a good dog. Snots has been with me now. Snots 16 years old. And Snots, Snots, my old, you know what they say, man's best friend. Yeah. And that's what Snots has been to me. Yeah, well, now, if I start you, thinking, man, who, who put you up to calling and fooling with me? I'll get uh, emotional about it. Uh, no, I read about it on your website, backwoods at backwoodsboxers dot com. Uh huh. Because I go through there and look at different dog websites and look for the right the right mate for snots. And I thought that your dog Taylor would be the right mate for snots. Because uh -huh. I want an award winning dog there. I think snots deserves the best. It sounds like you got it. Well, I've got it, but he's not the one for your snot. I, I'll be real honest with you, Betty. Uh, my lady is the one putting pressure on me to get this done. Okay? And she's in the other room right now. And she's the one that keeps telling me I got to get it done, get it done, get it done. And well, how old you say your snot for? Six, snots is 16. Well, see, now there again, Snops, I just don't believe that you've got no 16-year-old pit bulldog. Then why not? Huh? Because they don't live that long. Well, they sure do. Huh? You take care of a dog, right? And they can live a long you know, time. You be about like a 100-year-old woman having a baby. Well, but there's nothing, they, there's ain't no, no stopping it. It happens. You <laughs> hear about it. From time to time, you read stories in the news about it. 
you got to have a little faith. Uh, yeah, well, my husband put you up to this. I don't know your husband. Well, you need to is all I can say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, w will you tell my lady that you, you just can't do this because yeah, she doesn't I'll think I'm her. making any calls yeah, asking I'll for people? Yeah, I'll tell her. You tell her? Yeah. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take the phone to her. Okay. Okay. Hey, Verlissa. Verlissa. Yeah. Verlissa, I've got the lady on from the break, the the dog owner on the phone. Yeah, and I want you to get on so she can tell you that she's not gonna be able to breed with snot. What do you do with my Marlboro cigarettes? That's my last cigarette. Where'd you put them? <laughs> 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 that Felicia sounds like a great gal, doesn't she? She just got out of the penitentiary. <laughs> Sergeant Carter. <laughs> Hello. I don't appreciate you hanging up on my uh, lady like man. Well, I'm sorry. Uh, well, I am too. I'm sorry about the whole thing. I don't mean to bother you at all, but Snots needs a mate, and I was just trying to make a call to please Verlissa. Well, you don't know what it's like living with Verlissa. No, I don't. No, you don't. You heard her getting on to me about her cigarettes already. First thing in the morning, she doesn't say I love you, honey. Nothing. First thing in the morning, she's getting on to me about cigarettes. And there's Snots is up now. Snots has to go out. You better put my cigarettes down, dog. She don't. <laughs> she doesn't even like the dog. <laughs> Snots just paints a good picture of a great dog. <laughs> Is it? I don't. I don't think really that we're getting anywhere with you. Uh, Get off my leg! Turn to loose of my leg! Now she's got go Verlissa's leg. leg. <laughs> hey, hey, Sarah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> At least spend a few minutes on the other leg. <laughs> Jealous. <laughs> Do you have a daughter by the name of Emily? Not anymore. Yes, I do. And she's probably, uh, I, I, well, let me rephrase it. I'm probably going to used to have a daughter. She used to have a daughter oh. named Emily. Uh, Sarah, you're on the Stephen D.C. Morning Radio Show. And, of course, your lovely daughter, Emily, said, have some fun with Mama. <laughs> Okay, thanks. We thought we'd have a little fun. <laughs> now, we want you to give Taylor a little pat on the head and a scratch on the belly for us. I will do that. I mean, sounds like you have a real winner there. I mean, the, the 2001 American Boxer Club. Yeah. Yeah. Dog with its own website, backwoodsboxers.com. Correct. There you go. I'm wearing my boxers this morning in honor of this call, Sarah. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Yeah, that was just for you. <laughs> Sarah, thank you for uh, for your time, and uh, tell Emily we said hello. Okay. All right, bye-bye. There's uh, Sarah South.